Hey cool friends, I'm Bianca Renee and you're watching Bianca Renee today. And today I'm gonna try something that's pretty trendy on social media right now, which is called net plopping. Net plopping is just a different version of plopping or wet plopping. Probably should have made a video on plopping before I made this variation of plopping video, but um, yeah, my bad. But I did make a plopping video on TikTok and Instagram, so if you have decided not to follow me, then you must not want all the curly hair tips. So plopping is a styling technique where you put your stylers in your hair, you flip your head over into a t-shirt, tie up the t-shirt and let all of your hair sit on the very top of your head, creating more definition and more volume. It's the only way I would ever suggest sleeping with wet hair, if you absolutely have to. So net plopping is the same concept, but we're gonna be putting all of our hair into a net. I am, oh, I am proud to say that net plopping was kind of invented by one of my curl friends, Penny Tovar. If you don't follow her, follow her on YouTube and Instagram because she is hilarious. I really want her to get to 1 million subscribers, but she just decided one day that she wanted to plop, but she wanted her hair to be able to like breathe and air dry faster in a net. So she uses a wig cap. Wig caps do usually have a little hole at the top, so she must have tied it. But I also saw my friend Hi Felicia use fishnets instead. So for my net plopping experiment today, I'm going to be trying it with fishnets. You can get these off of Amazon, and I just like that it's a little bit bigger, and you could just tie this up at the top. So without further ado, let's get started. Today's video is sponsored by Curlsmith, so I'll be using all of their products, but even if this wasn't sponsored, I'd probably still be using their products. But you wanna start off with freshly washed hair. I use the Detox Kit by Curlsmith. This has three different steps in it. So with the Curlsmith scalp recipe, you wanna start off with step one, which is their Super Slip Prebiotic Primer. It's a pre-wash treatment for all hair types and scalp types. The main reason that I love to use this primer is because it has fermented rice water, which you guys might know from the DIY videos going around that rice water is really good for hair growth. So I personally love that I'm getting the rice water treatment without having to actually make rice water. Now with the primer, you do not rinse it out. You leave it in and then go directly to the wash and scrub detox probiotic, which is step two. It's a clarifying scrub shampoo for all hair types. Another popular DIY thing that smells horrible that I really don't have the energy to do. So I love that the apple cider vinegar is in this shampoo. And the last step is the postbiotic calming conditioner. This has hyaluronic acid, peppermint oil, lavender, tea tree. So you really feel that nice tingly feeling on your scalp, letting you know that it is getting a nice clean. And the fact that it has hyaluronic acid in it, which is just going to give us so much moisture. Every time I use the scalp recipe line, my scalp feels amazing and my curls feel clean yet hydrated. So now that my hair is nice and clean, I'm now going to style my hair using the Curlsmith Style and Slay holiday kit. I wanted to share this with you guys if you guys are looking for an awesome Christmas gift for anybody that you know with curly hair because you get three amazing stylers in it. The Hold Me Softly, which is a soft hold cream styler. The Curl Defining Styling Souffle, which has a medium hold and it's kind of like a jelly consistency. Or the In Shower Style Fixer, which is their strong extreme hold gel. I personally love all three of them. They all work great even individually, but today I'm gonna try a new little cocktail for the first time. I'm gonna grab the Hold Me Softly Style Balm as step one. Now for a little bit of hold, I'm going to add one of the gels on top. I have recently tried the souffle and that was amazing, but I haven't tried a cocktail with the in shower style fixer yet. So I'm gonna try it today for the first time. We're doing a lot of experimenting today. Now technically I'm already breaking the rules because when you use the in shower style fixer, it says to apply literally like in the shower. That's why it's called the in shower style fixer. But the main point is to apply it on soaking wet hair. So I need to re-soak my hair because I did do my makeup first, trying to be cute and whatnot for y'all. And the in shower style fixer gel works amazing even when you don't cocktail it. It just has a really, really strong hold. So just be prepared for that level 10 hold. Can we take a moment just to take in how long my hair has gotten? Yeah, I also think that's because of girls. So grabbing the Hold Me Softly Style Balm, which is a styling cream for curly and wavy hair. Oh, it smells amazing. And I'm going to smooth this all on my hair. You might get better results if you section, but I'm a two section type of girl. I 
forgot that a little goes a long way, so you really don't have to use as much as I just did. <laughs> This smells like it just smells so good it has like its own signature curl smith smell it has rosemary oil apricot smashed avocado squeezed olives like it sounds delicious now i'm going to add my gel which is the in shower style fixer styling gel for curly and coily hair stronghold high definition definitely anti-frizz so i'm going to grab about that much Rub it together. And the reason why I wanted to use a stronghold gel is because when you're plopping, you're air drying. And this is the quickest air drying styling product that I own. So if I ever want really good day one hair and I want that cast to form immediately, this is what I will grab. Okay, so now that all these stylers are now applied, the curls are already looking very defined, let's start net plopping. So I'm gonna grab my tights, my fishnets, and I'm going to plop all of my hair inside here somehow. Okay, here we go. Flip my curls over, open up the tights, and then just plop the curls. Okay see how we look oh yeah it's sexy kind of shake it so they all go on top then I'm gonna do a little crisscross and then gently tie it around just like that so now I'm gonna let this sit for a little bit then I'm gonna come back and diffuse and I'm back it's been about mm, at least 30 minutes but I did notice that my friends usually just plop for like 10 or 15 minutes just to get some definition and some height on the top of their head and then they just diffuse so I'm gonna start diffusing now I do have the new Dyson so this might be very quick but I'm gonna diffuse a little bit in the net and then I'm gonna take it out to diffuse some more here we go Okay, a little dry. Let's see how it looks when we take it out. Okay. Um, <laughs> I personally don't think I notice a difference. <laughs> right out of here i mean it looks good but it looks like it does when i don't plop i don't know let's keep diffusing and see what happens so here we go here are the final results um my curls look bomb but i i don't know if it's because of the net <laughs> so here is the final result overall i love how my hair looks when i use curl smith products period but i do think that net plopping might have made a little bit more shrinkage my hair looks a little bit shorter than normal because i think it was scrunched up my hair doesn't look as elongated as it normally does and I'm not sure if I'm getting like extreme volume from it. My hair isn't completely flat on my scalp, so that's good. If you have type two hair, type three, big loose curls, I can definitely see how this could create more definition. But for me, just don't know if it was necessary. But if you're just looking for beautiful curls, definitely check out the Curlsmith Style and Slay Holiday Kit. I actually have a promo code for you guys. So not only is this valued at $36 and it's only priced at $25, I have a 20% off promo code. So if you use my code, you can get all three stylers at an even more discounted price.
But what about you? Does net plopping or plopping work for you and your curl type? I would love to know. Leave a comment down below. And if you try this and actually have success, please tag me on Instagram so I can see your results. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I post new videos every week. You also can follow me on TikTok, Twitter, and Instagram at Ms. Bianca Renee. And if you don't want to miss all of my Christmas giveaways, definitely follow me on Instagram right now. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching Bianca Renee today.